in this module we will be performing some UI automation so we will be creating a new folder called UI automation demo we will be using a unit testing demo project only so I will copy the same project paste it in this and we will open the project now what we will do we will be creating a tab bar because I want to demonstrate the multi controller environment also in this particular exercise so we will be creating a tab bar demo We'll be concentrating on this. We'll be creating one more UV controller. We'll be adding some tab icons. So we can add the tab icons here itself. So I'll say add files. I'll go to the given folder, tab icons. I'll create one more controller called controller2. So say view controller2. It's just a dummy controller. Okay. In my app delegate. I'll be creating the base controller of type UI tab bar controller. I'll write those four lines. So I'll say window equal to UI window frame UI screen dot main screen dot bounds to make it full screen. I'll say I'll create tab controller 1 of type view controller I'll say tab controller 1 dot tab bar item dot title equal to home I'll say tab controller 1 dot tab bar item dot image equal to UI image name home dot png I'll create an array saying tab controllers an array of UI view controller I up bank tab controller 1 similarly I'll create tab controller 2 we'll give him view controller 2 dot swift I'll say uh, gallery I'll say gallery dot png now I will create the base controller I'll say UI tab bar controller I'll say base controller dot view controllers equal to tab controllers I'll say window dot root view controller equal to base controller window dot make key and visit so I'll be making the color of the tab bar controller 2 as white and I'll run the application now in the UI automation exercise in this module we will be writing a script to automate all this process okay and we'll make sure that we resign this so I want the keyboard to go down right so in your this you can say name text field number text field resign as first responder so you run your application you put the values whatever you want say return it goes right so this will be doing an UI automation